Here's a walkthrough of my collision detection mount that I uh, designed and 3D printed. It works with two proximity sensors, as you can see there. Uh, this back plug here, uh, it also has three lasers on there so that uh, for zeroing in on the, the torch where you want it. Uh, the sensor, I was had some issues with the previous wire, so I had to get a shielded wire. It was getting interference from the cable. Uh, the torch cable. So once I got this new wire on here, it's working. Uh, I've tested it on four or five cuts with no problem. So I will take this uh, and clean it all up and make it look not, a lot nicer. But uh, basically what happens is you start your program. You start your program as you would normally. So I come up here and start. The machine runs. And so it runs over here, touches something. It stops right when it touches it. This comes back here, and then what I do is just hit resume, and it goes again, and again. If uh touches something, pauses. So that that way, if it catches on any type on the metal, any tips up or anything like that, it will pause the cut, and you won't mess up your cut. Uh, the the thing is very sensitive, as you see here when that light lights up, that's detection. So it's very very sensitive for a touch, but yet it will still uh we'll still go up and down and with no problem as it's touching off on the metal don't have any issues there so that's how it works and that's what it looks like uh, it does it says spring loaded down here so what happens is it it these uh it allows you to adjust the tension right here and make it uh stiffer if you wanted to or lighter depending on what uh how you have it set up